Hello, welcome to Beginning Level English for Elementary. My name is Miss Lewis, and this is Week 6. We're exploring places you go. Today, we'll be working on Day 3 of your packet, to the woods. If you have your packet, you can follow along and do them with me. If you don't, in the video, I want to make sure you're talking and pointing to the screen. We've got a lot of learning to do. Let's get started. First, we're going to look at three letters. They are O, O, D. Can you say those with me? O, O, D. Good. When those three letters are together, they make the sound UD. Repeat after me. UD. Excellent. We can put different letters in front of this to make new words. Let's explore some of those. First, we have the word woods. Look in the picture. I see lots of trees together. It's a little bit like a forest. These are the woods. Repeat after me. Woods. Good. A place with lots of trees. This word is almost the same. It's called wood. What is different with these two words? Yes, that's right. Woods has an S at the end. Wood has no S. The word wood talks about the inside of a tree. So maybe in your house, you have something made of wood. Repeat after me, wood. Now, this is a word I say a lot because you guys do a good job. And that word is good. When something is going well, I also might say excellent. Repeat after me, good. Our last word is hood. On a jacket, sometimes there will be a hood, which can cover our head and our ears to keep us warm. Now, let's say the words together. Woods, wood, good, hood. All of these have O, O, D, all of those have the sound UD. Now let's look at some sentences. I will read the sentence and I want you to find the word that has UD. Then we'll find the pictures. Number one, I take a walk in the woods. Can you find the word with UD? Yes, woods has the ud sound with O-O-D. Now look at the pictures here. Which picture is connected? Very good. You can circle it on your paper or point. Now let's read it together. I take a walk in the woods. Number two. They put wood in the fire. Find the ud word. Yes, wood. Look at the picture and now find a new picture of that. Very good. She, yeah, there she is. Number two, let's read it together. They put wood in the fire. Number three. You did a good job. Find the ud word. Here it is. Good. Now find a picture. Yes, I see the student is smiling. They tried hard and did a good job. Let's read it together. You did a good job. Number four. Put the hood on in the cold. 
find the ud word. Yes, here it is. Now find a picture. Excellent. Let's read it together. Put the hood on in the cold. Nice job reading. We're ready to look at our vocabulary today for our book. The first word is climb. What do you see in this picture? Yes, I see a person here in a tree. They are going to climb and go up the tree. Repeat after me. Climb. Very good. She climbs the tree. Look at this word. It says fly. Fly is what birds do in the sky. I see the birds fly. I cannot fly. My next word is log. Repeat after me. Log. Good. Log is part of a tree that falls down. Sometimes we see them outside and sometimes we can use a log to make a fire. This is another word, crawl. Look at the picture. This baby cannot walk. She is going to crawl. Repeat after me, crawl. Two more. This word says bushes. I see one, two, three, four. Four bushes. It's like a small round plant. Say it after me. Bushes. Yes. And in this per picture, I see a person hiding. Repeat after me. Hiding. They don't want someone to find them. Let's read the words together. Climb, fly, log, crawl, bushes, hiding. Great job. Now let's read the book about the woods and see if we can find these words. To the woods. Look at the picture. What do you see? Good. I see a girl. I see lots of trees. I remember the word woods means a place with lots of trees. Let's read. I see trees when I go to the woods. I see big and little trees. Look at the picture. I see a squirrel in the woods. It climbs up a tree. The squirrel sees me. Yes, here's our word climbs. Very good. What do you see in this picture? Birds. Let's read the words. I see birds when I go to the woods. They fly around. Fly. We know that word. The birds see me. Look at the picture. I see a fox in the woods. It goes into a log. The fox sees me. We see the word log. 
What is a fox? Yes, it's this animal. Good job to use the picture. I see bugs in the woods. They crawl in the grass. The bugs see me. I see a bear in the woods. It is hiding in the bushes. The bear sees me. I know the word woods. I know hiding, bushes. What is a bear? Yes, it's this animal. Good job to make a connection with the words and the picture. I run from the bear. Now let's do some writing. The question is, what do you see in the woods? And what do they do? Here's an example. I see birds in the woods. What do they do? They fly in the sky. Let's go back to our book to find more things that we can see. Let's use the phrase, I see. Here's, I see birds. What does the girl see on this page? Yes, a squirrel. So I can write, I can write, I see a squirrel. The next part asks me, what does it do? Let's go back to my book. It climbs up a tree. Hmm. I see a squirrel. It climbs. Nice. We can do something different too. So if I drew my squirrel here and my sentences, I can find another animal. Let's go back to the book. What does the girl see in this picture? Yes, a fox. What does it do? It goes into a log. I can write that here. I see a, not a squirrel, I see a fox. It goes into a log. There are other ones you can do as well. What does the girl see in this picture? Yes, bugs. And what do they do? They crawl in the grass. You can do this one by yourself. What does the girl see here? And what does it do? Good. Use the words to help you write. Now for our speaking. What do you see in the woods? Use your sentences that you wrote here to say, I see a bear in the woods, or I see bugs in the woods. You can call a friend. You can talk to people in your house. Tell them what you see. You can also tell them, I see people in the house. It's a good phrase to use for lots of things. Let's finish up using our words that we learned in our text to match it with the pictures. I'll want you to try reading it and find the picture. Number one, you read it. Good, my turn. The squirrel climbs the tree. Which picture? Yes, here is the squirrel. It climbs. Number two, you read it. The birds fly around. Fly? And you know birds. Very nice. Number three. The fox hides in a log. Yes, you have that one. Number four. You read it. Great. The ants crawl in the grass. And number five. You read it. The bear is hiding. Great job. 
Go back, practice it again.